Hi there, and I'm so excited that you're joining me for our May 2017 series of time management. I know I need it. I feel like most people feel really stressed around time, so let's take some time out for ourselves these next five weeks in May and really just start feeling confident about our abilities in this life, surrounding our time for ourselves and our families and our businesses and our work and our fitness and just absolutely everything that we feel like we don't have enough time for everything. So the way that these are going to work is I just want you to sit and get comfortable in a nice seated position, whatever works for you. I have a little meditation pillow that I like to sit on. It raises my hips up above um, my knees and so it's a little more comfortable. And I just want, I'm just going to guide you through talking to you about time management and I just want you to sit up nice and tall, gently press the crown of your head towards the ceiling, start taking some nice deep breaths, inhaling and exhaling, <sighs> feeling the shoulders relax, the core gently tightens to support you in this perfect posture and for the next five minutes just breathe deeply, listen to what I have to tell you and just go with it. Okay, so closing your eyes, sitting up nice and tall. I'm just going to let you take a couple of nice deep breaths first and really just settle into how you are feeling. If you're doing this in the morning, that's what I like to do it, but whenever you're doing it, just settling into how your body's feeling. Feeling that air fill up the lungs completely with every inhale. And just letting go of everything that doesn't serve you right now with every exhale. And you can feel those muscles tighten to support you. So as you're sitting here breathing, I want to put a thought in your mind. Have you ever thought of time as an illusion? That time doesn't really exist. There are things that come up every single day that we feel like we don't have time for, but we are forced to make time for them every single day. Continuing with your nice deep inhales and full exhales here. An example is if you are running late for work and you happen to hit a car accident on the way and it's a traffic jam and you can't do anything about this traffic jam, you're stuck in it. How frustrating is that? You do not have time for this traffic jam because you're running late for work. And so you have a couple options. You can take a nice deep breath, accept that this is what's happened, and you can show up to your job calm and collected and confidently let your boss know if they really are that concerned, hey, there was a traffic jam, I'm really sorry. But rather than rushing in, last second, super frazzled, being like, oh my gosh, there's a traffic jam, I couldn't control it, and just like going over the top, you're stressing yourself out, you're stressing people around you out, you are giving off this impression of yourself that makes you seem very very high paced, fast going, and it kind of gives off this irresponsible notion about yourself. Rather than walking in, you're calm, collected, and confident that you've done your best. You've done what you could to arrive, and something happened, and that's just the way life goes. Take a nice deep breath. Remember, Life is always going to throw these obstacles at you. And you have the decision to decide how you're going to react to them. Breathing deeply. Full inhale again. Expanding all that air into your lungs. Sighing it out, letting all that air out. When you take the time to own your decisions, 
and do your best every single day to the best of your ability, time can no longer control you because you realize that you have all the time. You're doing your best. So as you sit here, just try to relax into this moment. Let go of everything else you think you need to rush off and do right now. Notice if the voice in your head is turning on and trying to distract you and trying to think of all the other things you have on your list to do today and just breathe. You have this time for yourself. You have all the time for those other things. Think about that worst case scenario. What if you didn't get everything done? The world is not going to end. It's time for you to start setting this foundation for yourself where you realize you are putting forth your best efforts and that's all you can do. Time is going to fall into place as you continue to just let yourself be and do what you need to do. So keep taking another nice deep breath for me, a nice full inhale, feeling those that air come into the lungs one last time. Maybe even pausing at the top and then slowly Slowly release that exhale. Very gently with the exhale, feeling all those muscles gently contracting and supporting you, relaxing the shoulders. Wiggling the toes, fluttering the eyes open, maybe smiling and just take an extra moment here to just notice how you feel. Please do not rush off into the day you took five minutes for yourself today. Feel good about this moment before you do rush off and go, go, go again, okay? Time is on your side. You are in control of time. Remember this, okay? There will always be outside distractions, outside obstacles, and you are the one that is doing the best that you can to get through. Thanks for joining me here today. I'll see you again next week.